Welcome to Advanced LinkedIn Advertising. This is a sequel to my previous course on LinkedIn Advertising that focused on the low-hanging fruit with lead generation. I've been doing LinkedIn Advertising since 2011. I've worked for companies of varying sizes, including Sony PlayStation, where I was a global product marketing manager. I worked for a Google-backed startup. I've worked for numerous early stage startups. And I have an MBA in marketing from Philip Kotler School Northwestern University. Now, my last course was focused on the low-hanging fruit when it came to lead generation. Now what I'm going to do is teach you how to build bigger, more scalable, and more efficient full funnel campaigns so that you can build something that has a much bigger impact at scale. And here are a few of the key things that I'm going to cover. Targeting in-market and out-of-market buyers, so people that are actively looking for solutions and people that are not actively looking for solutions. We're going to go in-depth on some bidding strategies. I'm going to talk a lot about video marketing because I think it is one of the most underutilized opportunities and one of the most friction-free ways of educating and nurturing leads. I'm going to talk about full funnel demand generation. So it's not just how do we capture the people that are ready to talk to sales now, but how do we get people that aren't quite ready and convince them that they're ready to have sales conversations. I'm going to talk a lot about awareness marketing and not just sort of general, let's throw money to create awareness of our, our brand, but more how do we move people through the stages of awareness in a demand generation mindset. So segueing awareness into uh, proper lead generation and not just vanity metric demand generation. I'm going to talk about various approaches to targeting and testing. So we're talking about strategic level testing and tactical level testing. I'm going to talk about certain KPIs that you need to be measuring that often consumer advertisers measures, but business to business marketers often miss. So these are things like reach and frequency and why these are very important variables when it comes to uh, running a larger or longer term LinkedIn advertising campaigns. I'm going to talk about just scaling the campaigns in general. I'm going to talk about using LinkedIn for research and we're going to talk about other things such as the new spotlight ads and how to use dynamic elements in your advertising. This course is for people who want to learn advanced business to business LinkedIn advertising. So I'm not going to be talking about consumer advertising here. Let's get started.